It's been a year, Alex. What exactly is the plan here? Alright, listen. I know this isn't an easy time for you, and I wouldn't be ringing off if it wasn't necessary, but it is. Um, you're growing up now, you're becoming a man, and you got to go out there and find a job for yourself, make an earning. It's not through lack of trying, it's just that there's nothing. Well, practice makes perfect. No one's good at something on their first try. I'm not built for manual labour. Don't have the mental stability for a one-day desk job, and I certainly don't have the patience for retail, alright? Listen, Mum and Dad... No, I'm not listening. Mum and Dad raised me... <laughs> Alex! Alex! Um, shut up. society in school told us to be. I guess my biggest mistake was thinking he'd stick around. Damn, I'm sorry. Have you tried contacting him, telling him how it's affecting you? I couldn't. I never have to say stuff like that. It's not like I can come up with some big speech. He's happy. Why are you screwing that up? You can't know you would if you don't know each other. Here's what I want you to do. Write down everything you want to say to him, even if you don't send it. It's better than bottling it up.
Hey, Jane, uh, listen, I, I need your help, but I need to see you right away. This is my safe place. I know it sounds like trouble, but I'm here to get away. It's not exactly paradise. Sorry. Jane, I need your help. But I don't know how. I want to get in contact with him, but it causes me too much pain. I'm really sorry. I can't imagine how difficult this is for you. But you need to try and let me in. I guess you're bringing me here because you're doing that, though. We can work together on this. You're not what the world and Liam tells you you are. We can get your professional help and get the contacts that you need, if you trust me.